Hey everyone, welcome back to Playcraft the Nation Population 323, and welcome back to the next episode of our Pokemon Platinum Martelog. Today, I promise, I swear to you, will be more exciting than uh, than the last episode where we just ran around, uh, basically, freaking bird, basically uh, retracing our steps and uh, and doing a bunch of not fun stuff. Um, this episode will be a lot more fun, I promise you this, uh, because we're actually going to be heading to the next town and doing some stuff because we finally have the ability to surf now. Um, now as I fight these trainers, I know I said we were going to start this episode with a, um, possibly a sacrifice, um, but then I got to thinking, the, the big issue here, <laughs> almost threw up, the big issue is that uh, we're getting close to Iron Island, and once we get to Iron Island, there's a character we'll meet named Riley. Uh, who wants to heal our Pokemon he wants to do the thing where he like walks around with us and heals our Pokemon for free uh, I don't want to use that free heal. I don't want to take advantage of that Although he's gonna heal our Pokemon the entire time we're in there. I understand that um, I don't want to take too much advantage of that. I would rather just um... Oh, why does that have to be a Weavile? Why does that have to be? We literally already have established we have nothing for a Weavile Mmm already established I have nothing for you um we still have signal beam on angel and the I don't think you're gonna have the best you're gonna have is icy wind you're not gonna have icicle crash or anything like that you could have icy wind you're gonna go for the faint stack that's gonna hurt too oh please please angel Jesus that's too much damage. Um, that is that is too much damage. I don't know if anybody's told you this. That is too much damage. Um, I will get back to what we were talking about. Not the nasty plot. Oh god, we have to take you out this turn. I have to take you out this turn. Signal beam's the best chance. Signal beam's the best chance, please. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. We're four levels up. We're four levels up. That's what I'm talking about, Angel. That is what I'm talking about. Get the job done. Okay, anyway. Less scary now. Drift blow. Um... Anyway, what I'm talking about is uh, I don't want to use the heal for free, so we need to do it beforehand to make sure I'm not using the heal for free. At least, like, that's, like, my own personal... Dude, why do I, I keep getting calls from a number called Scam Likely. I'm not going to pick it up if your name is Scam Likely. Um, so, yeah, we'll figure out, basically, that bridge when we, we come to it. Um, we're a wind, eh? I, I don't really know how I'm going to handle it, but uh, I definitely need to handle it because uh, I did not mean to press fly, but I mean, it'll still kill you nonetheless, so. Um, we're going to need to figure out what to do. <laughs> it's all you need to know. Angel, come on back out and use another signal beam. We're also just like getting so low on PP, and I'm pretty sure, I'm not 100% sure, but I am pretty sure we have a rival battle coming up fairly s shortly. And... Uh, not having any moves for said rival battle is going to kind of stink. Hmm. I'm of two thoughts. I'm of two thoughts. Luckily, I think the Pokemon Center in the town is before... I'm trying to think. I'm going to go ahead and take the XP share, by the way. I think... I think we're going to give the XP share to Evergreen, actually, because you're kind of falling behind. <laughs> Um, yeah, so we're going to switch those eyes. What do you have before? Never melts eyes. So our ice type moves will be a little weaker, but, uh, we'll just try to adjust for that. Um, what, what am I trying to say? We need to heal before that, I think. It makes sense. And then, of course, we are going to get, like, a little bit of, um, I think you just have to stick through this battle. Yeah, I think you just got to stick through this battle, unfortunately. Oh, not the evasiveness. Not evasiveness. Evasiveness cannot happen. You got to stop. You got to stop gotta stop luckily i i gotta land one of these have to land one of these there we go that's what i'm talking about um like the rival battle is gonna be tough the rival battle is always a little bit stronger than the actual trainers uh and so not being in a good spot for that could be the death of us so i think i am gonna do the sacrifice beforehand i keep going back and forth in my brain but i think now i have decided that's what we are going to do um i just don't know who the sacrifice is gonna be because i literally love all of the members on the team right now. I know that Umbreon really hasn't had a chance to shine. Uh, but we all, uh, he's not even on the chopping block. We can't even... Really? With the Weaviles? <sighs> Why? Oh my god. Why is it necessary? I have nothing to take care of Weavile. You know what? Maybe Evergreen's the solution. You're going to withdraw the Weavile, losing your plus two, and you're going to go into Yanma. 
I can't say I back the decision 100%. Maybe I do. Maybe I do now. Gonna get the speed boost, and we missed. We snapped out of confusion, and we just end up missing. Go for the ice shard. Take him out this way. Okay, so you're gonna go back into the Weavile. I will switch into Angel, who has one more signal beam. No, you don't. Oh, crap, I messed up. Go for Surf. Icy Wind. Uh, it's okay, we got Soul Dew. It increases our special defense, and you're, you're a physical attacker, not a special attacker anyway. Yeah, okay, that's fine. Gonna lower the speed, but we're already slower. Surf is gonna get the job done. I do not want to see another Weavile again. I'm, do I'm done with them. We can, we can be done with Weaviles. Okay, so we've already got our encounter on this route, so unfortunately we can't get that encounter. Who are we going to sacrifice? Who is it going to be? I'm going to have to look and see who is in the, the PC. And honestly, maybe we needed an answer for Weavile. <laughs> maybe that is who our answer will be. It's Oak's Aid? Gilmore, long time no see. Oh, you look puzzled. You're wondering who I am. I'm Professor Rowan's assistant and Dawn's father. The professor asked me that I upgrade your Pokedex, you see. So I'd chosen this spot on a hunch that you'd pass through. Gilmore, may I have your Pokedex for a moment? Okay. What is it now? Oh, I can now display images of male and female Pokemon. That doesn't really do much for me, man, but uh, thank you. That guy's thirsty. I can't catch any water in this game because it's not the right game. Who are you? Talk to some random people. Anytime you're in a new town, you get to talk to random people. That's the best part of it. He found something. TM48. It's not skill swap. It instead is Hydro Cannon. So quite the water move if we ever get Blastoise. Or I guess we could teach it to any Pokemon we want. Okay, Hidden Power. Like, I know the battle's coming up soon, and I'm scared. Okay, you're the move deleter. We could maybe use you in the future. I don't know. Um, okay, so yes, yeah, so we can get to the Pokemon Center before, thankfully, uh, we have to do the battle. So we will do that, because I'm pretty sure it's right across the... Like, uh, pretty sure as we cross the bridge. I'm pretty sure as we cross the bridge, it's going to happen. So um, let us look in the box. Let us just... Let, let's figure this out. It needs to be figured out right now. We've made our way to box two, which is awesome. I mean, we have some good Pokemon in here. Okay, party Pokemon. So, Angel and Ninja are not available. These two cannot be sacrificed. Um, instead, we have to sacrifice Obama Snow. Oh, we have to sacrifice Evergreen, Gatorade, Enigma, or Nove. Don't have another fire type. Like, Nove doesn't have that great fire type moves right now, but we the fire typing is so helpful. And I can't get rid of him yet. We don't have anything else that has a fire type move. We may be able to get something that can learn like Fire Fang, but we don't have anything that is a fire type. As far as if we replace Evergreen, we would need a grass or an ice type. So, Swinub could join the squad. Mamoswine is a beautiful Pokemon. Uh, I don't really want Tangent. We could pick up Cancun. We could pick up Vaquero. And that's pretty much it for Ice and Grass types. I guess Shelter eventually becomes an Ice type as well, so we could pick up Vegas. But I don't like Cloyster that much. Um, Mamba will eventually become Dark Poison? We already have a dark type in Espeon, though. Maybe I should have... I should, definitely should have taken, taken Mamba instead of um, Umbreon, and that was my bad. Um, I wasn't really thinking, but uh, Drapion would be a much better choice than Umbreon. Although Umbreon's pretty tanky, so I can't get too mad at that choice. Um, if we get rid of Gatorade, we would need a water type and, or a ground type. So we could pick up Happy the Prinplup and get a steel type as well. Is that our only water? I guess Lombre as well and Shelter. We can also just pick up him on top, but then we lose so much coverage. I can't do that. Um, 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 um. Uh, we're also, you know what? Let's go ahead and, um, while we're thinking about this, we're also about to get, um, we have, uh, more things to hatch. We have more, uh, what are we, what are we trying to call them? We have more, please head to Warburg. We have more fossils to resurrect. So I think they're all gonna be duplicates of Pokemon we've already gotten. So we will have to check that. But for now, I'm just gonna move randomly. Just who's the first in the party? Just move Evergreen to the box. I know it's gonna heal him, but we're sacrificing anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Um, 
And let's heal, let's resurrect, I can't think of the word resurrect ever. Let's resurrect our fossils. We'll start with the old Amber, which I'm 100% sure we've already seen before. Uh, who were you? Who was this? Was it Pharaoh? It's another Umbreon. So this one we'll call Mr. <laughs> because we now have Mr. Ginger and Mr. We have Mr. Ginger and Ninja, so we'll take all three of them. We're going to go plop Umbreon back in the, the box because we're not going to be using that. We already have two more Umbreon to choose from uh, should the time come. So Umbreon, if you want to just plop yourself down right here. A jolly Umbreon, eh? Don't know that I'll be using that one, but uh, please escape. Uh, I don't think... Helix Fossil might actually genuinely be a new Pokemon. So we should... I think armor we've already done. So let's go ahead and uh, do the armor because I don't think this will be a surprise. I think this is one we've already done before. It is an Electrode. Yes, we've already received... I didn't nickname it. You know what that means. You know what that means. I mistakenly did not nickname my Electrode, which means this Electrode has to be sacrificed. Sorry, man. doesn't count as our sacrifice, but that Electrode is gone because I was too fast and did not nickname it. And that's a big old no-no in my house, at least. Okay, study fossils. Wait, are you extracting it? I thought I had one more fossil. Hello? Gone too long. A Geodude, eh? A Geodude. That is a new Pokemon for us. A Geodude. A rock type. A rock ground type. Hmm. Who would that... We could still lose the water typing, though, and that sucks. If you're quad weak against so many things. Um, at least, like, it's the return of Dwayne, which I can take some solace in. I love Dwayne, and I missed him. From our Volt White playthrough. If you never watched it, go watch it and you can uh, see the unfortunate end of Dwayne. <sighs> but I still love Dwayne. What am I going to do? What? This is decision time. Dwayne. Um, so, I think the correct answer, unfortunately, and it makes me really sad. Uh, because he's been with us for so long, but I think Gatorade has to go. I can't replace a fire type. Gengar is too valuable, and I think having this grass ice type is also so good. So, unfortunately, uh, we will go ahead and take that soul dew. This is the maybe the hardest decision yet. I mean, between... Yeah, but even, like, Bok and Pandora was a pretty easy decision. This is the hardest one yet. Um, but I think it is going to be Gatorade. So, whew, Gatorade has been with us since freaking Valley Windworks. But he is gone now, and now we have to decide do we want the to replace the ground typing by picking up Swinub or Nidoking? Or do we want we need the water typing? I mean, we have a water type move in. Hmm. Nidoking's not a bad Pokemon. Nidoking's not a bad Pokemon. Let's pick up Prinplup, mostly because I think the added steel typing could be ha good as well. So we'll pick up Happy right now. What level was freaking? It was 32, I remember. Whew. I've been bad about checking those lately. So, of course, we get to Rare Candy, our Prinplup, up to level 32, um, and see what you want to do. It's also going to have, like, Peck and stuff, so it'll have, like, no, I don't really care about Bide. Yeah, it has Peck. Uh, Metal Claw's nice, too. Yeah, I think that was the right decision. Um... It hurts, but I still think it was the right decision in the end. So, Happy, uh, we'll go ahead and level up Happy. Fury Attack, no. I'll level you up to 32. Um, you're going to be freaking a couple levels away from evolving into Empoleon, which is a beautiful Pokemon. I'm also going to give you the EXP share, even though I just gave it to Evergreen, uh, because I think getting you leveled up is more valuable. Take the, this from evergreen and now we can put back on the never melt ice who could we give the soul dew to we could give it to enigma I don't, I don't know if it works on pokemon other than um i don't know that it works on pokemon because it says to be held by latios or latias but i don't know if that means it only works for them or not so we are going to get our heal here as Prinplup joins the squad and we say goodbye to quagsire and now i'm finally ready to go back to candlelave city Candlelave. I never will remember the name of this town. We're here in Candlelave City, and uh, we're ready for this battle. So let's go ahead and lead with, uh, I think Gengar is probably our best lead. So let's go ahead and cross the bridge 
and get run into by our rival. Whoops, hey Gilmore, you're gonna challenge the gym leader up past here, huh? Someone should check to see if you're ready for this challenge. That someone is me with my brand new gym badge. You didn't even have a chance to go to the Pokemon Center to heal back up, man. Tropius is gonna be your first Pokemon, uh, which is no trouble for me because both Sludge Bomb and Thunderbolt would be great, but Sludge Bomb is definitely the better. It's Stab and it's super effective, and Tropius is a tanky mon, but uh, you can't take on Enigma. His lead is 36, by the way. It's not good. This music's good. Your own Gengar is gonna come in now, so, oh, it's such a tough. Okay, so I'm like, if a couple mines here, Jinja is tanky and could take him on that way. Angel has the soul do, so if you're gonna shadow bomb me, I could probably live and I could get off a luster purge. I think that's the correct solution. I think that's the correct solution. Man, the fact that he has a Gengar kind of sucks. 38. He's gonna go for the shadow ball. We have a soul do. We have the soul do. So Angel should be fine. Angel is not fine. Hopefully this Luster Purge takes out in one hit. Um, if it does not, we are going to have some problems on our hands. But it does, and that's all that matters. It is Stab. I mean, it's it's a legendary, so shouldn't be surprised. That could have easily killed us, though. Um, keep an Angel for Weeping Bell because it's not that scary. I am going to heal up real fast, though, even though I just said it's not that scary. Gastro Acid? My ability was suppressed. Oh, you gonna earthquake me now? Bring on. If you taught your Weeping Bell Earthquake because this is a randomizer Nuzlocke, I will give you money, but you didn't, so. Easy, Arcanine's gonna come in next. And I already miss, I think we just have to stay with Angel. Um, Intimidate's gonna cut our attack, but that doesn't matter, I hit on the special side. Um, I already missed Gatorade. <laughs> Gatorade was my, I'm scared, I'm gonna go into Gatorade, but, uh, the Electrolytes are with us no longer. I'm going to get roared out by this Arcanine. You're going to bring in Jinja. Well, that's the biggest mistake you've ever made because Jinja can go ahead and quick attack you and probably take you not out, and we're going to get Fire Fanged. All right, and we get burned. That's great. Don't heal up. Doesn't heal up. That's great for us, and uh, we're going to get hurt by Burn. You're going to go into Magneton now, uh, which is Nove's time to shine, although we really need, like, really, really, really need a little better fire move than Ember. Lock on. You're going to zap cannon me? I would love... I'll pay you money if you zap cannon me. I'd love to see the day. You're not going to get the chance, Spark. That's okay. It's going to hurt, but uh, not that badly. Yeah, we're fine. And then we'll go ahead and finish you off with one more Ember. And that's going to be Percy down the drain. That fight would have been very difficult without having uh, that brine you want to learn, huh? I can't remember if you're more of a physical attacker or non-physical attacker, but water sport is definitely garbage, so we'll get rid of that. Yeah, yeah, you're a bit better than me as usual. But listen up. Let me tell you who's going to take on the Pokemon League and become the champion. You guessed right. It's going to be me. Anyway, you should go to Iron Island and toughen up some more. Yeah, train at Iron Island. That's what I did before going to the gym. Okay, I probably do need to toughen up some more. He's not wrong about that. Let's go ahead and get a burn heal going for Jinja. And let's also take a look at uh, Happy because I never did. So let's go ahead and take a look. Happy is naive nature. Mm, you're more of a special attacker and you have Torrent. Okay, and there's your move set. Okay, it's not terrible. It's actually pretty good for us right now, uh, but we're going to be heading over to Iron Island, so let's get ready for that, and let's hope it's not, uh, I mean, basically, as soon as we make it to Riley, oh, it's so scary with Riley, though, because no, everybody wants to interview me. I'm not that popular. What do you got? Sailor Eldra. Is this the one with the sick kid? No? No? Your sailor dad's missing. Okay, well, we'll find your dad. He's around here somewhere. There's something down there, which means, uh, well, first of all, we are going to be able to get an, a Candlelave City encounter, so let's go ahead and get ready for that. It's going to happen right now in our Candlelave City encounter. It's going to be an Ella kid. You know what? That's not bad. That's pretty... I mean, it's good, actually. I don't know why I'm saying not bad. Uh, let's go into Jinja. Jinja is our tank, so we'll use Jinja to get through battles like this. We need to get some freaking wish action going up here and harness the actual Mr. Ginger Ninja strats, but uh, I don't have that currently. That did more than I wanted it to. That's okay. Um, let's just try to throw a Pokeball at this Elekid. And by Pokeball, I mean Master Ball. Just kidding. Great Ball. Let's throw it at this Elekid. We have an Ele I'm going to check after to see if we have an Electri Electorizer. And if we do, Elekid is not joining the squad yet. All right, got a little premature, a little ahead of myself. My bad, my bad. We'll try again. 
that's gonna do it. Okay, Elekid's gonna join the squad. I'm gonna see if we have enough for an Electivire, because that would be delectable. Elekid is the electric Pokemon. It's electric woogie woogie woogie. A weak electric current flows between its horns, sticking a hand in there shocks the unwary. Well, uh, we're gonna call you, what's that? I'm gonna call you Tesla. Cause it's kind of like a Tesla coil and also Tesla's a guy, so. And it involves electricity in some way, shape or form. So, uh, excuse me, Tesla is gonna be your name and you're gonna get sent to the box as we come down here and we find what this item is right here. TM28 dig could come in handy, maybe. I don't know that it's going to. Okay, um, let us see real fast. If we have an elector electorizer, and if we do, just go ahead and call it. I see the protector. I see the protector. I know we have like two magma risers, yes, but do we have an electorizer? I'm scanning my brain, trying to see the E, the E, the electric. Electorizer, electric. Do we have two dubious discs, four shed shells, electorizer, electorizer? I don't see it. Six upgrades we have. Okay. Uh, no electorizer, so no electivire is going to happen, but you know, it's still cool. Uh, we're going to go ahead and set sail for Iron Island, where we're going to not only get another encounter, uh, but we're also going to start training up because uh, we're not necessarily a low level, but we're kind of a low level. So who's living here? Is this Riley's house? I think this is Riley's house. That's what we got here. We got a red shard going on here, and I think we pretty much... There's Riley right here. You are... Okay, you're Gilmore. I'm Riley. I'm a trainer, and yes, it is a bit odd that I would be training here. Anyway, it's always nice to meet another trainer. Here's a gift. Strength for free. Okay. Cool. Uh, I have to get the mind badge. He's going to go training inside, so we don't get to join him yet. One of these has something. Okay, it does not. Uh, we don't get to join him yet, but... Eventually we will. So we're now inside Iron Island. So let's go ahead and walk around uh, this upper level here. What is this? It's freaking like Darkrai or something? Or it's like, what is it? Reg Ice. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. He's going to explode. Is he going to explode? 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 Oh, what do we have that won't kill you? What do we have that won't kill you? Thunderbolt's not stab. I'm scared to switch Pokemon because of the explosion. Ginger can take the explosion best. Icy Wind can also take the Icy Wind pretty well. Um, I think he might press explosion, so let's be safe. Let's be safe. Superpower? No! No, 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 no. You can't do that to me. Okay, I'm alive. And your attack and defense are going to fall as a result. Get him with the pursuit. He's gonna curse. He's gonna curse. That's okay. That's so not enough damage. I think I gotta try to confuse him. Confuse right there. You go. Try to hit yourself in confusion. Icy wind is gonna connect. That's okay. And uh, yeah, just keep going. Just keep going. We're gonna be fine. Confusion. Okay. It'd be cool if you like hit yourself ever. I'm gonna heal up one more time, just to be safe. He's confused. He's gonna get it through again, and this is gonna be a plus one superpower. We're fine. It's gonna fall again. Okay. It'd be cool if he ever hit himself. That's a crit. Confused, hurt himself in confusion. There we go. Okay, so now we take this opportunity. We jump back to Enigma. We put you to sleep. Icy wind, that's okay. That's not okay. Put you to sleep. Missed. Put you to sleep. Missed. Put you to sleep. Hits. There we go. Okay, 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 okay. Get the job done, Enigma. That's all I needed from you. We're not going to use a Master Ball on this guy, but I will uh, go to the Ultra Balls uh, because this is a big boy. This is a big boy, Regice, and I would like him to join the team. I would like him to join the team. One, two, three. Legendary on the first ball. That's what I'm talking about, man. Boosh. Um, Regice has been caught, and it's the Iceberg Pokemon. Its body is made of ice from the Ice Age. It controls frigid air of negative 328 degrees Fahrenheit. Well, I don't know what that is in Kelvin, but I like the name Kelvin, so you're getting the nickname Kelvin. Also, we saw his moves. He didn't have explosions, so that's good to know. Kelvin is going to go ahead and get sent to the PC. Another freaking legendary, but again, we can only have one at a time, so that's fine. And we're going to start exploring through uh, Iron Islands. We are going to have a lot of trainers to battle, um, as well as a lot of wild Pokemon 
that are going to be trying to get all up on us. So that's going to be obnoxious. Kangaskhan is going to come out. I don't know that you have anything for me. You may have bites, but other than that, Sludge Bomb is going to... Well... Enigma. I did not think you were living that. I did not think you were living that. I'm going to be 100% honest. I thought you were so dead. I thought you were so dead. I thought you were so dead. Oh, okay. Enigma lives. But freaking let that be a lesson, me. To not do that anymore. You're going to endure. That's fine. The poison will take you out. God, if we lost Enigma, I would have cried. I would have cried. It's a Zelf going to come in now. We'll go to Angel, and we will hit you with the Signal Beam. You're level 36. That's okay, though, because I'm Angel. Um, yeah, I'm definitely going to have to do a bit of grinding in this cave, unfortunately. Like, it's just an unfortunate uh, combustion. Uh, I need to heal up bad. I need to heal up very badly. Also, shouldn't even, I should have just healed up in that battle because if, you know, some... Body once told me if by some magicness there we didn't escape, we would have died. So that's not good. A sky plate, I think we already have one of those, so that's not that big a deal. What do we have going on on the other side? Combuskin, Combuskin, you want to fight? I only want to fight Pokemon I can actually take down like this Mime Jr. May not seem like the greatest use of our, of our PP, but remember we're going to be meeting up with Riley soon. And Riley's going to hook us up. Um, I think Sludge Bomb will kill you. Riley is going to hook us up by healing our Pokemon, so I'm not saying we should take advantage of that fact right now, uh, but I will say we can take advantage of that fact right now, so might as well and get some experience for everybody around the board. Put it on the board! Okay, what do we got down here? You're hiding something. You're hiding something. All right, nothing to be hidden. Um, the trainer battles are scary, mostly because they're so strong. Kicknia, it's a Kicknia. Sweet, it's another item here. We're also getting a bunch of items. Dragon Fang. We get a Boizel. What's scary about the double battle, like when we beat up with Riley, it's going to be double battles and double battles at this level, like literally could kill us if Riley's Pokemon sucks. Like usually he has a Lucario. If he doesn't have a Lucario and instead his Pokemon is hot trash, we could be in a lot of pain. Garchomp is here. Uh, we could be in a lot of pain as we start doing stuff. Lava Cookie. I don't think I'll be eating that, but thank you nonetheless. Your sacrifice means the world. I should probably just throw up a Max Repel because... Let's be honest, I'm not really uh, doing what I'm supposed to be doing here. Where are my max repels? There they are. Uh, I'm not really, like, fighting anything anyway, so I feel like... Why worry about it, you know? Okay, uh, but we'll fight the trainers, and we're going to have a Starmie, which is an easy Shadow Ball opportunity for us to take you out in one hit. Okay, so when it's not scary, it's not scary, but when it is scary, believe me, it's scary. Okay, Enigma. We'd like to grab this item. It's a zoom lens, our 97th of this LP. So I'm not interested in that. And we're going to go down. Riley is to the left. So let us explore to the right first. Which is going to be more trainers. But uh, that's okay. That's okay. The trainers don't scare me that much as long as they don't take down my boys. We got a Swallow right here, which I think we are fine to face. I don't think you know anything. Yeah, that'll be easy. And next we got a Meowth, who I'm going to give to Evergreen. Because Evergreen needs a little loving. Give me all your loving, something and something and something, 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 something. Go ahead and hit him with the Ice Shard and his life. Meowth is not a scary Pokemon, okay. Uh, also, the items are nice here because you never know what you're going to get like a Macho Brace. Also, got to be something hidden here. Got to be something hidden here. There's no reason for this otherwise. Got to be something hidden here. All right. So you just like, you just like have poorly designed caves. I mean, I've never designed a cave myself, so I feel like I can't judge you too hard, but I also can't help but feel like maybe you did a dumb there. We got Lancer in here, which I think we're fine to just Shadow Ball. You really, though, you're stronger than I thought. The thing about Enigma is that he's very, she is very frail. And so, Drain Punch is an awesome TM. I'm glad to have it. This cannot be a, don't tell me this is dumbly designed too. Really? Oh, there we go, we got a Star Piece. Okay, I'm like, there's something here. Repel's effect wore off. Uh, let's just go ahead and go for it. I'll fight whatever wants to fight me. I mean, I'm not going to fight something like that. But uh, let's go ahead and head over to Riley now, who is going to... See, like, I'm scared to fight that because, like, if Thunderbolt didn't kill, which I think it would, we would be dead. Riley is here, and Riley's going to keep our Pokemon healed, so I'm sorry, but... Again, if a Pokemon dies during this, they're still dead, but... Gilmore, I'm glad to have see you here. If you don't mind, let's team up. This Pokemon does... does the Pokemon seem to be restless. 
Okay, so we're going with Riley now. He's gonna keep my Pokemon fully healed, which is so nice of him. Thank you so much. Unfortunately, we're gonna have to fight all these trainers double. Oh, really? Put him to sleep. <laughs> Put him to sleep. Uh, that is the way you do this here, and you Shadow Ball him and you kill him. Thank you. Um, Stunky is gonna come in. I don't know, really? Stunky is... Are you dark yet? I can't if you're part dark yet. Let's just go into Jinja because Jinja's a tank. Toxic, really, though. Yo, toxic. I'm slipping under the of your boss. Uh, I think we're fine just going to Angel here. And just hit him with a Dragon's Breath because it's a strong move. And also, I'm Dragon type. And Kabut Tops is going to come in now. And that is a battle for Evergreen if I've ever seen one. Unless you hit me with like a Rock Slide or something. Endure. That's fine. You can do that. Because the Hail going to take you out. Uh, maybe Riley only heal. Maybe Riley only heals our Pokemon. So like, here's a double battle. Yeah, okay, now we're healed. Okay, so only in double battles. Do you have a Fero? It's like very bad. <laughs> it's like very bad, but it's not, it, it's a pretty bad Pokemon. I'm gonna try to take on most of the trainers by myself, just so I don't have to worry about, like I said, double battles introduce so much uncertainty that I cannot deal with. What is it coming in? Uh, we'll go for Surf. I guess we'll go for Surf. You don't have Storm Drain, so that's good. Your special defense is going to raise. It's still going to raise. This is obnoxious. This is obnoxious. All right, well, you're getting Signal Beam instead. Acid, that's fine. We'll be fine. Um, and what's going to come in next? Nothing. Okay, so yeah, anytime we get a wild Pokemon encounter, our Pokemon will get healed. So I could just like... I know that theoretically I could just throw up repels and be like, ooh, I found, I found a way. I found a way to avoid battling, but I'm not gonna do that because it's kind of scummy. Uh, oh wait, no. Actually, it's the reverse. Technically doing that would be the least scummy thing, but I'm a scumbag. So instead I'm going to do this and uh, end this thing's life. Yeah, this Fero sucks. So trying to get stuff done with the Fero is not gonna be fun. Firestone. Could be useful. They are Celebi and Charmander up in this boy. <laughs> That's pretty exciting because they're going to be some good experience. Uh, but yeah, this Pharaoh is not helping us out like at all. So it's pretty much like on us to, to get stuff done. And again, I will fight these trainers one at a time because it makes the most sense. I'm a champ is here. I don't think you can do that much to me. You're going to go into smooch them. I like the, I like the move. Uh, but this little baby Pokemon is dead, unfortunately. A Tentacool is gonna come in, which is time for Angel. I'm not trying to, to speed through fa too fast through this, but also I feel like, um, like taking advantage of the free heals is scummy, so I feel like I should try to get through it quickly. Like, I'm, I'm of two minds. Part of me is like, well, you should like try to train up as much as you can because Entei. Part of me is like, Train up as much as you can, man, because you never know when you're going to get an opportunity like this again. But part of me is like, that's scummy. So I don't know. I'll probably go somewhere in the middle where my Pokemon gets some decent levels. Also, I don't know if you just noticed, we're about to see something pretty cool after this battle. Um, because a certain Pokemon just reached a certain level. And really, that hurt me? I didn't know Covet hurt. I don't, didn't see what was coming in. It is a seal, uh, which is pretty much the exact opposite of what I want to be in for. I used to have a teacher. I had... had I mean, I'm not at college anymore, but at college, I had a professor, strange man, strange dude. I liked him a lot, but strange. Anytime someone did something well in class, like answered a question, right? He would give them the seal of approval, which is when in the middle of class, he would stand and go, arr, 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 arr. pretty weird. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. No more anecdotes about school. What's happy is evolving. Well, that makes me pretty happy. Not only because I get to change the layout. Who keeps calling me? Anyway, but we're going to get an Empoleon. Which is a steel type. Which is a steel type. Which is good. Happy involved into Empoleon. Uh, and wants to learn Aqua Jet. I believe at this point you are a more physical attacker. Hmm. Let's go ahead and get rid of Bubble Bee. Because I think Brian's better. Although it had more PP, so maybe that was dumb. But a priority move is good. Awesome. Uh, so I'm going to go get this item real fast. And then I'm probably going to do this one battle real fast. And then I'm probably going to end this one here. 
Um, I also think I need to, I need to, before I end this one, because I am going somewhere, so I'm not going to be playing, I need to switch over my EXP share, Max Elixir, I need to switch over EXP share, I think, to Evergreen now, uh, because Evergreen's starting to fall a little behind, so we'll just give you the EXP share so that you can become the man that you've always wanted to be. Switch those, and uh, let's take a look at Happy and see these new stats. All right, you're definitely a special attacker, so that was dumb to get rid of uh, that for Aqua Jet, but doesn't matter. Um, I'm going to go ahead and end this one here as we continue exploring through the Iron uh, Fuego place, whatever you want to call this, Iron Works. Um, and, you know, we'll probably, I'll probably be running around and training up a bit, but I don't want to do it too much because I don't want to get too over-leveled, but also I don't want to be under-leveled and, like, get rocked at this next um, gym battle because I think it's going to be pretty difficult. So, uh, I'm going to end this one right here while I'm fighting Pokemon. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you subscribe to become, you survive that? A citizen of Playcrastination today, and if you know anyone that you think would be a great Playcrastinator, go ahead and send them on by because we would love to have them. But with that, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time.